Hi, everyone. Welcome to Freebird Spirit YouTube channel. Thank you for stopping in and hanging out for a little bit as we check into the energy surrounding Mitch McConnell. Should be interesting. Let's go for it. I'm going to put it on the card view here. I'm going to be using the, this Kipper deck. And the tarot cards right here, we have the tarot Illuminati. And this deck here is Spirit Within Tarot by Steve Bright. Okay. Alrighty. So let's take a look here. And we will get started. I'm trying to find Luna another little spot she can hang out. So, because as soon as these cards come, come down, she's going to start wanting to get right on top of them. All right. So, Mitch McConnell, let's check in. I'm going to do an overall, overall theme to the reading card. Okay, what I was seeing, what they were showing me as I was tapping in, he's sitting behind his desk. I feel like he has a team around him that kind of, so he says, you know, you know they, they keep coming in and out and uh, he sits there. I feel like if he was a drinker, he, I, you know, I saw him with a, you know, some bourbon or something there, um, but if he doesn't drink, he might want to right now. I don't know, <laughs> but kind of just what now, what now? Okay. I need you to be doing this. I need you to be doing this, but he's just kind of like sitting behind his desk. Okay. <laughs> we have the 10 of wands coming in as the overall theme to this. So he is very burdened right now with this whole deal with what's going down with Trump and the whole Republican Party. So we're going to start, let's see if we can get a story here with the Kipper cards. All right, let's take a look at this, this story together. Okay, I'm going to get up here. So I, if you can see these, I don't know if you can see the actual words, so I'll, um, I'll speak them out so you can hear me. The middle of this entire thing is courtship, okay? On either side, you have imprisonment and thief. Up here, you have sudden wealth change, despair. Down here you have great fortune, concern, and false person. This just reminds me, I, I mean, there's a lot of challenging cards here for him, regarding him, but he is just feeling stuck in a place he does not want to be uh, stuck in this relationship. I know this is a courtship card, but it, it shows this. And it could also that he's trying to keep people. He's trying to get um, backing or supporters or you know that kind of thing uh, but he's he's his hands are basically tied here and uh, it also could be talking about the election right where you know you're focusing on trying to um, still the election somehow right but he's having trouble with this it's like He's, it's not working, right? That could be what's going on here. 
Above here, you have sudden wealth change and despair. So there's some something um, unexpected and quick coming in, some information of some sort. It's going to really change everything. Any type of plan that they may have had is going to be changed, and it's going to bring in massive headache, despair, uh, the ending of whatever they thought they had. They were trying to still here. It's going to come to an end. Down here, you have great fortune. So there's a lot of concern, a lot of information, a lot of things that are underground and unseen or whatever. Probably it could be regarding money, you know, as it all usually is. Um, but there's, it's cause for great concern. And then you have the false person here. It's someone who's, who's, and if we went back to, if you saw my Trump video just earlier that I posted before this, if you haven't, check it out because he was the false person in that. So it's trying to, to bring about this false person in but it's, but they're very concerned about, they're probably concerned about revealing who this is. Who is this, guys? Who is this? If it's not Trump, because that was the other reading, it could be someone else, and, and they have concern that, with, that they have all this, that if she would, if it's a she, which is a she here, then um, her being revealed and being brought out. But you can see here when you look down the line, so this would be right here you're looking at uh, the recent past, sudden wealth, imprisonment, great fortune, and that's kind of all wrapped up in finances and things being revealed and um, possible indictments coming, and that's, that's what this is all about here. It's kind of all coming to the surface. Uh, currently, you have the courtship, you have the concern, you have change, courtship, and concern. And so there's concern, and they're looking at making a change. Okay, so now this story takes another, another curve in it, right? Oh, gosh, did we even look? Oh, yeah. Ooh. Okay. <laughs> You're like, what, what, what? So that would, that would go with what that's going on with there. Okay. Um, yeah. Yep. <laughs> You're like, what, what? Okay. So uh, as the story goes, uh, okay, more concern. Okay. And we'll get into this, but as we look at here, it, it looks like because of the concern, they may need to, because of the concern of everything, they may need to make a change. But we just had the convention. Um, but they're looking at possibly changing and supporting a different person. And here we have, we have message of concern, bad health, journey. Again, another message, you have the courthouse and it's regarding the main male who sits in the place of high honor, okay? So that's kind of that message in looking at possibly choosing a different pathway, okay? Choosing a different pathway, uh, giving an offer to someone else to and, and uniting with someone else there for the, for the presence, for, for them to back, for them to, yeah. So this is kind of, unex so we're kind of, they're kind of waiting to hear about this offer and if they're going to move forward with this they're kind of i don't know this is interesting isn't it <laughs> interesting storyline i don't know and i keep saying i don't know because it it's fluid and it's showing that it's still fluid even in the reading 
that they're kind of waiting and waiting for its change. But then we have in the near future, we have despair, thief, and false person. So that is coming up for them. Uh, that there, it's going to be revealed that Trump totally has been stealing, but how did they not know? And then he's not who he, he's not really the president. It's all going to be coming out and it's going to be a huge burden, burdensome thing. All right. <laughs> quite a story, quite a, quite a, quite a story. It's painting here. How did they, how did they not know? I, I, you know what I mean? They do know, they do know is what I just heard. But as it's being revealed, that's where the despair comes in. As long as it's hidden, you know, they're, they're good with it and they can keep it hidden. I don't know. That's just, it's just confounding, I tell you. All right. Let's All right, let's take a look. We have the Ten of Cups here in the middle. So that's kind of the, the center here. And, and in this reading, it's not the happy, like everything's in place, emotions in place and whatnot. It, it's something else, but let's take a look. We have the Four of Cups here, the Emperor, uh, the Ten of Cups, the Five of, the five of Swords in reverse here is in the challenge area. And then um, kind of the action or the outcome or advice uh, is the hangman in reverse. And I feel right here is they're, they're making this offer, okay? And in this four of cups, it, it's definitely not what someone wanted, okay? But the offer's there and they're just kind of like, that is, I don't know if that's gonna work for me. And then you move into the emperor where, and I know it's not in reverse, but in this reading I'm seeing as, as a person who's stubborn and immovable, okay? And then you have the Ten of Cups coming in here. And uh, I just feel, again, with the cups up here, you have a, a lot of a lot of different emotions coming together at once. Um, and then we have the Five of Swords here in reverse in the challenge. And that's bringing in, uh, you know, they, they're no longer going to be getting away with, they can't get away with anything anymore because it's all coming, it's all going to be out in the light. So that's a challenge for them. So they're trying to work out some things here. They're trying to make it happy for him, for Trump. But he's, he's not happy about it, but he, they're trying to set it up to, to make it like it's going to be okay or something here um, because it's all coming to light. They, they can't get away with it. Uh, it anymore and they got to figure it out and so they can't just lay there and hang out like what I was being shown at the beginning of him just kind of hanging out there uh, they can't just sit there and hang out anymore they have to take action some way or another they can't hide behind their delusion and and their their party anymore they just can't hide behind that anymore so they're going to have to take some kind of action and it's a big burden. I'm interested in what you have to say about this. If you have more to, to say. Um, I did, however, see something here. Yeah, I forgot about this and I, I apologize, but let's go back. Um, we have great fortune change in false person. So there's, 
that one keeps coming on not no joke about Trump. So I, I keep hearing that. So it's going to change for this person. He's no longer in the lucky, lucky seat where he keeps getting away with all this stuff. And we all keep thinking, how does he get away with this? How is this possible? It is confounding. We could miss one payment on something and the, you know, they're knocking down our doors. You know what I mean? And he can get away with the massive amounts of stuff. It's, it's, it's impressive and wrong. So you have sudden wealth, concern, and despair. So this sudden information that's going to be dropped in, it's bringing in great uh, concern for Mitch McConnell, and it's going to put him in despair. Yeah, and this thief is coming in and taking, creating this interesting. So you have imprisonment, despair, and false person here. So isn't that interesting? So I feel like, do, do you guys feel like this is possible in, indictment? And I don't, I guess, I guess as the president, you can't be indicted, but you tell me what that means someone someone's going to be indicted maybe he maybe mitch mcconnell himself huh. let's see let's see what i'm hearing let's see if i can tap in a little bit more about this let me ask Okay, I'm seeing, they're showing me just everybody scrambling now, scrambling and, and shoving papers in here and hiding stuff here. And so I think, I think he might be feeling a little bit nervous about being indicted or drawn into to the mat, all this chaos and um, madness of lying and, and stealing and, and all that. We do have the thief there, so he might be a big part of what all that's been going down. I mean, according to what they just showed me, they're all anxious, carrying that burden. All right, thanks for hanging out and, and talking this through. I'm interested in your thoughts on this. And take care of yourself until next time, and I'll see you then. Bye.